I just left my vacation appointment. I got waxed yesterday. I didn't show too much. Probably just a little, some little snippets that I probably saw. And probably some little snippets of me being getting my little vacation, but nothing too much because you know it's an intimate area. But right now I'm outside my little um, salon studio for where I got it done. I'm about to head to the mall actually. I'm about to go to the Opry Mills to get some last minute stuff. Y'all, I'm so tired of shopping. This is coming for me, like, people would think I'm like, oh, like, like, you like shopping. No, I like a good deal, I like a good sale. But I actually like shopping, especially for like a trip that requires so much clothes and so much stuff. For us to be there for a little amount of time. I'm so tired of shopping. <laughs> like, I'm tired, I don't want to spend more money on this trip. I'm ready to go, like, I'm ready to go. That's about where I'm at, so. I'm gonna go ahead to Toppy Mills. I'm probably like 20 minutes away from there to go grab some um, some Crocs and get some skincare stuff. I got my face started the other day too. So I wanna just get my skin at least prepped and ready to go when I actually get my actual facial. Cause I don't know, maybe it's just me. Like when you get threaded, your skin's a little more extra sensitive and everything cause the pores a little more open and all that. So I need to get my little stuff. And I think that's really, I think that's all I need to buy. Well, at least right now, like I might have to make a trip to the um the beauty supply store. Oh. Do I want to do that today? No, I might not do that today. I might do that tomorrow or Monday. If you're wondering where I'm going, I'm not gonna tell you until I put up the video where exactly I'm at. But so excited to go! Can't wait. The best hint I can give you is somewhere tropical. So yeah. Other than that, child, like I said, I'm ready to go. I'm supposed to leave my actual flight. I'm supposed to leave Thursday, next Thursday, to where I'm supposed to be going. And I need to finish up all my appointments by the Wednesday. Because while well, I'm flying out, because it's too expensive to keep flying out from here down to Nashville, so it's cheap for me to fly for ATL. So, do my hair Wednesday, get that knocked out, so I can fly out to ATL in the evening and catch my flight Thursday morning to my destination. Alright y'all, so I just left the Croc store. Unfortunately, they don't have an altar in here. That's why I can't go to Sephora and get some of the things I want, but I think the Sephora has my skincare brand that I usually use on my face, so I might have to go to Green Hill. Hello, good morning, beautiful people. Today is Monday, March 6th. It's about 11, 12 a.m. Right now you see my hand, my little silly plaits. At the moment, I'm actually about to wash it. I'm about to shampoo and deep condition my hair in my little um, um, microwavable heat bonnet so I can deep condition it and start cleaning my appointment because my apartment needs to be clean before I go so I can come back and I can just get a jump start and a lot of other things I need to get working on because I have other events and other things I need to do when I get back on this trip. But that's a after we get back type of thing. But right now we need to get this started because my hair appointment is on Wednesday. So I'm doing it a little early because I don't want to have to rush and try to do it tomorrow. Hello beautiful people. So back again. As you see my hair is no longer in plaits. It looks like Sealy. I now blow dried my hair, so this is done. Just off the checklist. Uh, is my apartment clean? Yes, yeah, still working on it. Uh, I'm gonna finish that task by the end of today. I don't care if I have to come back home from work late tonight and finish cleaning this apartment because I still need to pack two because my packing is gonna be done tonight. I don't care, I don't care, I don't care. I would stay up if I have to. My packing will be done tonight. And I'm even happier that, for the most part, all my packages are here. All my Amazon packages are here. My last clothes package got here because Fashion Nova was low-key taking their time getting my shorts here, but it's here. So I can pack tonight and tomorrow I can just go just straight and record content before I go on my trip. And I can just do my beauty appointments. I worked my last day today before my trip, so I'm also excited about that. I'm ready to go. I'm tired of looking at work. I'm tired of looking at people, at least 
work people like i love my work people but i'm tired of looking at y'all right now i need a break i need a woosah but right now it is about 2:48. about to be three so i'm gonna try to do as much as i can before i leave because i have to go in around four so i got about like an hour ish give or take but as you see, I have, I'm also on a different camera. The quality completely different and I love it. I'm on the Sony XV, not X, Sony ZV1 camera and I'm absolutely loving it. It's a typical vlogger camera, but I can see why so many vloggers use it. It has excellent quality. I think the details on this is actually really good too. Now note this, I didn't buy the camera just yet because this camera is actually really expensive. I decided to rent the camera just to see kind of how I like it, see how it works, see what features is on it, and like, you know, if it's really worth the investment. And so far, I'm thoroughly impressed. But the true trust is going to be when I get to my destination, I'm really going to pull it out for that. Because honestly, I wanted to give a little something different for the trip, a little something different for the vlog just something a little different i want to try something new with regards to like maybe like editing transitioning regards to shooting and all that i want to try something a little different so yeah can't wait to show y'all when everything's done and complete but so let me get up and get as much as i can done before i go to work i'll talk to y'all when i get back bye Woo. good morning it's about 11 25 11 30 and i'm running late but I got my Starbucks, got my ham and, crud, ham and cheese croissant, banana nut loaf, and my strawberry acai. Got something a little different today. But I'm running to my facial. So my original facial kind of got rescheduled. So I'm going to someone else, but I'm actually running behind because me and my numbers, I don't know why I keep doing this, but I'll spend the win on my way when I get in there. But hello, hello. So I just coming from back from my facial appointment and as you see my skin is a little glowing and I'm really happy with it like originally I was gonna be like no I'm not gonna get the facial after my original esthetician canceled on me but I still want to go to get a facial because my facial look he kind of needed it and it's been a while so I'm just like let me just treat myself I like her I found on Groupon like really I was eyeing that deal for a minute I was like okay I'll try one of these days I'm like okay this opportunity went and tried it out i really enjoyed the facial i didn't really record the facial just because i just wanted to tune out and just relax she was so like um attentive to my skin the little detail she oh i'm like she did while like doing my whole time facial the massage uh it was just nice and she's so sweet she's so sweet so she'll see me again i really like i like her i like her and it's not far from my apartment either so i really appreciate that too but I'm happy with the results happy with the results so right now i'm probably gonna get my feet done because honestly i passed the nail salon down here I really i booked an appointment but i'm like if i'm out right now i might as well just go get my feet done so i might just call the place and see how much they're charging for a gel um pedicure and i passed by a target i'm gonna see if they have an alts in there because some targets have altas to see if they have my my um skin brand that i'd be using Oh, but I'm gonna see if there's any Alta's nearby, really, because of the neighborhood that I'm in. The town I'm in is kind of bougie, so really, I'm hoping there's an Alta nearby. And probably go to a dollar store and go pick up my little, like, essentials for um, my travel needs. And probably head back home. <laughs> hello good afternoon it's about 2 37 so about like a little after 2 30 maybe 2 40 i'm dealing i'm leaving the nail shop now i got my toes is done if you don't see it's cute got some cash for my nails tonight and for my hair tomorrow because i gotta pay in cash um my face is actually doing really well like i first was still in flame it's actually doing quite marvelous a lot of my acne from yesterday is gone so I'm so happy about that. Um... All right, y'all. So I just left the doll family dollar. I got. 
sometimes that I really get. A few things, I'm not gonna lie. For about almost like under $40. I basically got all my travel stuff that I was basically looking for, like every last travel thing. Like the only thing I didn't get was probably for like the house. It was just like some rinse aid for my dishwasher. So I might try to see if I can find that somewhere along the lines of that. But other than that, I was able to get everything. I got me some snacks, I got some of my travel essentials and everything. And honestly, that was probably a whole lot cheaper for me to go here than me going like CVS or anywhere else. So happy with that. Knock that out. Uh not my Well, good morning, beautiful people. Today is March 8th. It's like 6.43, 6.42 in the morning. It's very early. I see my nails are done. They're so cute. She did a great job and she was so sweet. I, I absolutely enjoyed her. So far, I've been enjoying all my beauticians, honestly, who've been doing all my services. They were absolutely sweet. They were really accommodating. They were really attentive and they take really good pride in their work. And I absolutely love that. I appreciate it. But right now, I'm running to my hair appointment. So I've been to her before. I really, I've done my locks with her when I went to New York for Labor Day. So she's doing my boho knotless braids today. Love that. But. Thankfully, she texted me saying she's running a little behind too because low-key I kind of got up a little late So I was supposed to originally get up like around 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning to finish my packing Like I finished packing my check bag. I did My check bag is done. It's my carry-on that I really had to finish Because I need to put in um, Some last minute stuff in it. I need to finish my carry-on so probably like when I get back home I'm gonna hope I we can get my hair done in a pretty decent manner and I can go pick up my currency that I still have maybe like an hour or two before I have to head to the airport that I can finish it because I low-key need to do a really really fast wash before I go to and pick up some last little bit of stuff so yeah I'm, if anything I might just send my little pickup who's giving me an NATL to just pick up my last minute stuff so I don't gotta watch do it here I'm tired, I'm tired of running around so much. Like yesterday, I ran around so much yesterday and granted, I needed to do it. And I, got, I knocked out a lot of stuff that they much need to be done. But because of that, because I was out a lot longer than I thought I would have been running and doing a lot of errands, it kind of it kind of pushed back my time a little bit in regards to like me finishing packing and me finishing cleaning my house before my nail appointment. So like, I don't know, it, it's, it's the pro and con of it because if I didn't do my errands yesterday, I would have never gotten it done. Oh, I wouldn't have got the things that I needed. Oh, I would have been rushing low-key today trying to get it done and whatever. And I wasn't trying to do that either because my time is very limited today because I'm getting my hair done. So I'm going to be in the chair for a little minute. Not saying like she, she's a very fast braider and everything. So I probably can get out of the chair at a decent time. But in the same sense, I don't want to bank on that based on like the length and what type of style I'm doing. I don't really want to bank on the fact that, okay, yeah, she's a fast braider. She may take up the whole time. She may finish a little earlier. So I'm really just trying to just focus on just doing just the bare minimum today and just getting done. So like I said, like if I can get home preferably around, if I can get home before four, like around like maybe like two or three o'clock, I'll be freaking happy. Not even get home. If I can leave the chair by like two, if I can leave the chair by like two, three o'clock, I'll, I'll be more than happy because then that gives me enough time to go do my last little bit of stuff because I can go exchange my currency real fast. I can go run to my job real quick and go pick up something I, I left yesterday and I can go, I can probably go to the beauty supply store and then I still have enough time in my home to just finish up some last minute stuff before I have to head out with all my lift. So yeah, <sighs> busy morning, but your girl's excited. It's for me, like this is literally like my day right before I go type of thing because really I have to, Flying to ATL tonight, and then I leave tomorrow. Or, ooh. 
All right, also, right now my Chick Fil A. Trying to get my breakfast. I need something to eat while I'm in the chair because I'm not going to try to play myself this time around and be like, no, I don't need any food. I'm just going to go straight to my appointment and go grab my cash because I need to go grab like the remaining amount of my cash for the appointment. No, no, you girl's not doing that because I mess around, I'll do that and I'll be sick for the rest of the day. I'll be irritated. I have a headache. No, I was like, I'll just go get my little breakfast now so my day can go smoothly because I'm really not trying to be bothered. Like, for the most part, I've been having a great past couple of days. Like, I was bothered at work. I was bothered here. I mean, yesterday, I I got no complaints about yesterday. You know, like yesterday, yesterday wasn't exactly what I planned it to be in regards to certain things. I had no complaint. Like, all right, y'all. So I made it to my appointment 10 minutes early, actually. So I'm loving that just because I low key been running behind on appointments a little bit this whole entire week, but I'm happy just to get, I got here, I got everything I needed, I got my breakfast, I got me a little spicy chicken biscuit with some bacon on it, and some hash browns with some orange juice, so I'm gonna eat my little breakfast until she gets here, and knock out this last appointment, and be ready to go. But hey y'all, so I forgot to film my outro actually just cause my hair appointment actually ended up going a lot longer than expected and I had to catch my flight to ATL. But that concludes my vacay part with me. I actually really enjoy making this vlog. I will actually will make more of these in the future. Not just for, like just vacay prep, but just maintenance vlogs period. But go watch my next vlog for where I'm going and I'll see y'all soon. Bye.